everyone, Angela Silva here. Happy 2020! And my first beauty YouTube video of the year is just my daily go-to makeup look when I wear makeup. And I'm really excited because this is my first sponsored beauty video. And Stylish reached out to me and said, hey, do you want to try some of our makeup brushes? And actually, my little brushes that I use for eyeshadow and stuff had just broken. Like the tip came off the stick part and I was like, perfect timing. Yes, I will only ever promote products that I will actually use and that I found useful. So in this video, I use my new and stylish brushes and you can use code Angela S at instylish.com to get 10% off your order and it doesn't have to be these brushes. It can be whatever you want. So here we go. All right, so the first thing I do on a daily basis for my basic makeup look is foundation. I, my favorite drugstore foundation is L'Oreal Infallible. It's total coverage and it really is total coverage and lasts a long time. It's my favorite. So I use clean fingers to apply. Sponges absorb product. I like most bang for my buck. I put a little bit on my finger and I apply it almost like lotion, just all over my face. A little bit more. Next, I fill in my eyebrows a little bit. I use my Brow Pro palette from Five Below, and I'm really excited to use my new InStylish brushes because my other brushes broke. It was perfect timing. I use this small angled brush, dipping it in this darker, just very, very lightly. I'm gonna mix it with the lighter, tap the excess. I start in the middle and go up to the arch. Outline it first. Then I use whatever's left to go fill in towards the inside of my brows. Okay, moving on to the next one. Happy with the brows. Now I'm moving on to a little bit of contouring and blush using my City Color palette, also from Five Below. It's my go-to. Just add a little bit of dark color, tap off the excess to the back, right under my cheekbones. We go up here, my temples. And then I line my nose using the same brush because I'm in a hurry. Just along each side. Perfect. I used a larger angled brush for that using a bushier round brush for the blush and I'm going to do a little bit of highlighting. So 
So I did it up on my cheekbones, down the bridge of my nose, in the center of my forehead. All right, using a little bit of blush. It's a Maybelline palette, got from Target. It's called Master Contour, but I'm just using the blush right now. Using the same brush, dipping it in my blush, tapping off the excess right on the center of my cheekbones. A circular motion. Face is done. Moving on to my eyes. I outlined my waterline, which is the bottom of your eyelids, like right where your eyelashes grow. I'm using a Maybelline. I'm using a lot of Maybelline products. This is not sponsored. I just like them. Maybelline Unstoppable because it doesn't smudge. Some other, I like retractable also, so I don't have to mess with sharpeners. Anyway, it just stays all day and it doesn't smudge. So I just blink into it as I apply it onto my waterline. All right, next I'm going to do my eyeshadow. My favorite palette is my Too Faced Peach palette. I won it on an Instagram giveaway like three years ago, but I just love it. And I'm gonna use my new In Stylish brushes. So first I use a flat brush to apply like the base color, which is usually more neutral color. Um, I'm feeling a little extra today, so we're gonna do something sparkly. If you have something really pigmented and sparkly, it's good to get your brush wet. I'm gonna spray it with some of my NYX finishing spray. And I'm going to use this orangey one called Peaches and Cream. And kind of press it into my lid. All right, happy with that. Then I'm going to use my bushier, but still small round brush to do a little bit of a smoky eye. Just a little bit on the outsides of my eye. And I'm gonna use like a mixture of these browns at the bottom. This one's more of like a rust color. Summer Yum Puree and Caramelized. Kind of tapping at each and tapping off the excess. I'm gonna push it into place a little bit. And then I'm gonna use rounds circular motions to make sure I blend really well. I do not like harsh lines. It is always easier to add more product than to take off too much product. That's like my one of my rule of thumbs when I'm applying makeup, especially eyeshadow. If you're going for a smoky look, start light and then just layer on more if you want it a little bit darker. So I have found myself having to take off like my entire face of makeup because something has gone wrong because of it being too dark weird lines, whatever.
happy with the eyeshadow. Now I'm going to use my NYX liquid liner. It's matte black. I'm going to start in the middle of my eye and work my way out following my lash line. Now I'll go back in. Alright, other eye. Oh, hi, also, did you guys know I have a podcast? It's called the Better-ish Podcast. It's all about realistic self-improvement with a dose of humor, and I do it with my childhood friend, Malin. You can find it on iTunes, Spotify, wherever you listen to podcasts. All right, happy with the eyeliner? Eh, I'm going to fix this wing a little bit, even it out. All right, good enough. All right, last is mascara. I'm using NYX On The Rise. It's one of my favorite volume, volume mascaras that I've gotten from Target. Start at the base, wiggle it up. Other eye, other eye. Now, I'll use the residual on this wand, I'm not going to dip it again, to do the bottom lashes, just barely touching them. Oops. 
All right, and the last step is lips. Even on a daily basis, I go to one of my favorite darker purple colors. It's Revlon Color Stay Ultimate Suede in Supermodel. It's my favorite. It's like a good purple. It's just my favorite. All right, I finish off with the finishing spray to make it last all day. And here you have it, my daily makeup look for 2020. Don't forget, you can go to instylish.com and use discount code Angela S for 10% off your entire order. And it doesn't have to be these makeup brushes. It can be anything else on their website. However, I do love these makeup brushes and they are my new go-to that I will use every single day. Don't forget to subscribe. Let me know what other content you'd like to see on my channel and see you soon.